take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Move to a colder place where the temperature never goes over 60 degrees and out of sunlight. Keep it indoors if you live in dry and hot areas of the country. Sometime in May, repot the poinsettia in a bigger container. Cut all the stems down to about 4 inches. Make your mark, take our lead. Poinsettias also like lots of direct light. Place your plants near a southern, eastern or western window and keep the soil moist while they are still in bloom. Balsas warns against allowing poinsettias to sit in water. Instead, gently remove the plant from its container, soak it well and place it back in the pot. Make your mark, take our lead. Growing poinsettias. Indoor light. Put in a south, east or west window where the plant will receive bright daylight. Outdoor light. Part sun, 4 to 6 hours daily. Temperature. Indoor temperatures of 65 to 70 degrees Fahrenheit as ideal. Take our lead. It is possible, but it just doesn't happen if the plant is indoors. Poinsettias require very specific light conditions to allow the plant to make flowers again. Your poinsettia should be moved outdoors during summer, so it is important to keep it in good condition now. Often, blooms will last for months after January. Make your mark, take our lead. Toss the poinsettia when you grow tired of it or it becomes unattractive. For those home gardeners who enjoy a challenge, it is possible to get the poinsettia to bloom again next season. Cut the stems back to within 4 to 6 inches of the soil in March. The poinsettia may also be repotted at this time. Let's help you make your mark. The time to plant poinsettias outside is late March, after the danger of frost has passed. Until then, keep the plants in a sunny window and water when the soil begins to feel dry. Just prior to planting, cut the poinsettia back about halfway, even if the colorful bracts are still on the plant. Take our lead. After all the leaves have fallen, store the plant, in its pot, in a cool, 50 to 60 degrees Fahrenheit, dry, dark area. Keep the plant somewhat on the dry side. Water only enough to keep the stems from withering. Figure 1. Parts of the poinsettia. Make your mark, take our lead. Poinsettia care was fairly easy, so the plants became popular at Christmas time due to their festive red and white colors. Poinsettias need not disappear after the holiday season. These plants can be kept alive and healthy year-round with just a bit of special care. Make your mark, take our lead. Two years. Home gardeners generally keep their poinsettias one or two years. If they're really dedicated, maybe a little longer. But the lifespan for interior plants when you live in the north is measured in months, not years. Take our lead. Poinsettias are relatively easy to keep alive during the short holiday season, but getting them to rebloom next year is a more challenging undertaking. Once the colorful bracts fade and fall off the plant after the holidays, 
Cut back the stems just below the flowers. Let's help you make your mark. Poinsettias will classically drop their leaves if they are exposed to sudden changes in temperature, drafts or overly cool or dry rooms. They also will lose leaves and wilt in response to an extreme need for water. When choosing a plant, pick a healthy, full one with no discoloration on the foliage. Take our lead. Poinsettias cannot live outside where the temperatures drop below 45 degrees and they cannot tolerate frost. Poinsettias, Euphorbia pulcherima, originate in Mexico and thrive in the heat. They can grow up to 8 to 10 feet tall but without regular pruning they will become leggy and weak. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.